Wait, you hear that? I hear it. I smell it. Ghouls. Necrophage is following. Let's go before any more show up. Ever tell you about this sorcerer I knew? Couldn't stop talking about how useful they are as creatures. Because you can brew potions from their blood? <laughs> no. Because by eating rotting corpses, they prevent epidemics. Hmm. Did he know they eat the living as well? No. Really upset him too. His theory collapsed. It's not exactly going our way. We have a side. The Northern Realms. Radovid's realms, don't you mean? Temeria and Eden are no more. Radovid's pledged to restore the old borders as soon as he wins the war. Believe that? <laughs> Gotta believe something. It's what keeps us going. Has it gone? Yeah. Come out. Gods, that was close. I was sure I'd end up like my mare. Provided you got lucky. Your horse died quickly, but griffins like to toy with their prey. Eat it, alive, piece by piece. Oh. You'd... you'd like a reward, I suppose. You don't owe us anything. You were in need. We helped. And they call witches heartless. Say they won't lift a finger without pay. They also say mice are born of rotting straw. Back to the trail? Like I said, leads to the main road and ends there, muddled. You seek someone? Yes, a woman. Medium height, long black hair. Seen anyone like that? No. But... There's an inn here in White Orchard. Sole one around. Gets its share of travelers. Perhaps you'll learn something there? Besides, the innkeep's my cousin. Tell her Bram sent you. She'll treat you like family. Not a bad idea. Especially since that wound needs cleaning. 
Ah, beast barely grazed me. But sure, could use a good rye, nice and cool, you know, straight from a cellar. Let's go. Come on. This close to the village. Strange. My thoughts exactly. In the forest or the mountains, sure, but here? Near the main road. Maybe it's the war. Corpses everywhere, the stench of blood, burnt flesh. Drives oh, monsters yes, crazy yeah. sometimes. Men, too. We need to watch ourselves in White Orchard. And we should leave as soon as we learn it. <laughs> Take it easy. The Temerian lilies, they've a right to hang there. This ain't Temeria no more, old man. It's Nilfgaard now. My arse it is. Drink with Weaver Lost Freaks. Beg your pardon for those thugs. No need. We're used to it. Folk are jumpy around here. Armies just passed through. Now a griffin's prowling about. Mm hmm. Already had the pleasure. Ran into your kinsman, Bram. Bram? How is he? Alive. Sends his regards. Master witches. Food and drink on the house. What can I get you? Looking for a woman. Raven-haired, violet eyes. Dresses in black and white. Riding in from Willoughby. And, uh, strange as it sounds, lilac and gooseberries might have smelled that. I've not seen nor smelt such a lady. I believe I'd remember. Yeah. Especially hard to forget this one. Plenty of travelers about, though. Folk from all over. Might be worth your while to ask after her. Thanks. For everything. Master Witches, would you be of a mind to kill the Griffin? Beasts are scourge on our land. Only killed livestock at first, but it's got a taste for human flesh of late. Well, I feared to set foot outdoors. If someone will pay us, won't say no. Help you bandage that up? Please. I'm not decrepit yet. Then I'll ask about Yennefer. Mm-hmm. Just remember, we'd rather not draw any attention. Yeah. Black One's been out measuring the fields. Let him measure. Better that than burning the harvest. Oh, drum all. Dr I'm looking for someone. And we seek some peace and quiet. Out of my face, freak. For your breath sours my beer. Red woman dressed in black and white. Seen her? Talk. Folks say the lady rode through the village a few days back. Galloping so fast she knocked Radabor into a ditch. Which way did she go? Dunno. Lots of tracks leading off the main road. Could have gone anywhere. Oi, people! 
The Frank's taken Micah's mind. Uh-huh. And I'll take your tongue if you don't shut up. Four factions, teams, suits, similar to clubs and spades, except each suit has its own face card. Looking for a woman. Uh, like everyone. Not like everyone. And not just any woman. Mine smells of lilac and gooseberries, dresses in black and white. Two schnapsies. <laughs> It'll lift your spirits. Fine, I'll have a drink. Can we cut to the chase? You seen her or not? Yennefer of Vengerberg. Never mentioned her name. Yet you described her perfectly. And once I hear something, I never forget. Can't help it. What do you do? Who are you? A mangy vagrant. Gaunt to Rodim. At your service. Vagrant. That a profession now? Uh, once a merchant of mirrors. The madding crowd dubbed me Master Mirror, or the Man of Glass. How do you know Yennefer? What a question. Master Dandelion's ballads, of course. The only way a humble merchant might hope to rub up against greatness. Unless, that is, he's as lucky as I am. And runs into a very patient witcher. It's a Geralt of Rivia himself. The Butcher of Blaviken. Recognize me from Master Dandelion's ballads too? To your health. You seen Yennefer? Deepest apologies, but I must ask. Is this about love? Guessed it. It's love. I knew it at once. What do you know? Tell me. Before you appeared, it never occurred to me that might have been Yennefer. Who would have thought? Get to the point. An Ilf Guardian scout from the local garrison saw her. Where? At their camp. She rode in there. Dark of night. Black and white. Gooseberries and... Yes, I know. Had a terse exchange with the garrison commander and raced off. Where to? <laughs> I'm not omniscient. Ask at the garrison. Thanks. We men of the road must stick together. Perhaps one day I'll be in trouble and you'll be nearby to help. 